I confess I took your hair pick. You don't even do your freaking hair, Michael. Why would you do that? Oh, uh, it's, it's a quick, uh, quick hair comb. Well, buy your own. Oh, I'll get you one. Hey, where are you going to church at? What? Are you going to Champion Life for Church? Uh, yeah, Gina and I have to go to our special service. So you're not coming to St. Mary's? No, I don't go to Catholic churches. Well, that's a Catholic church. Champion Life. And I have a dresser being delivered this afternoon, and I'm in a bad mood. Another bad mood. So, I'll give you a call when I get back. I'll try to lighten up, huh? I'm to get happy a little bit for a change. Really? Why? Well, because I have freaking migraines every fucking day. Oh, that's why, yeah. Because you're always, uh, I don't know, you're always in a bad mood. You don't want to be in a bad mood all the time. Turn it around a little bit. You know, turn it around. Can you do that? Try to do that. Try to turn yourself around and say, I'm going to be happy. I'm going to be glad. I'm going to have a good time. I'm going to enjoy myself instead of that, you know. Try it. All right, I'll call you later. it will be all right. Just try it, okay? Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait a minute. What time do you want me to pick you up? I don't. I have to be here to have a dresser delivered. Oh. What time? I don't know what time they're bringing They can come any time. Well, it's Jean's daughter, so it'll be after church sometime. Hey, did you get my messages last night? Yeah. Well, did you listen to them? Yeah. What do you think? What do I think about what? The messages. What about them? Well, are you, are you going to kind of listen to it or what? Well, you have to remember, my phone only lets me 
once you leave, like, a 30-second message, if that. Oh, I didn't take any more than 30 seconds. Well, I didn't really hear anything spectacular. Well, what do you expect? You expect me to be... I have to go get ready. I will call you later. You expect me to be spectacular all the time. I'll call you later. No, seriously. About that apart. Okay. No, wait a minute. Uh, wait a minute. <laughs> well, come on, I'm gonna get ready to go. That apartment you have, that is ideal, and that is a place to stay probably the rest of your life. I wouldn't move out of there if I were you. Well, I'm not planning on it. I ain't time soon. I want to be here for the rest of my life, though. Well, you could. Probably. I mean, that's an ideal apartment. You have, like, the way back, you know, secluded. And, you know, there's not really too many people in, the, in, the, in that building. And, and, I mean, you got a maid, babe. You, I mean, you have it really nice under your nose. And, and you know what I mean? And it's, it's, it's a new apartment building, too. It'll, it'll probably be up there another 200 years. So, you know what I mean? Yeah, think, nice think before you want to move, because you don't. That'd be stupid. Oh, and is that your litter out the parking lot, by the way? What? Is that your litter out the parking lot? Probably. Uh-huh. Well, there's cameras out there, Michael, and the only one that's going to get bitched out about it is me. Tired oh. telling you to stop littering. You want litter, you do it on your own time, not where I live and not when I'm around. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay. Bye. Yeji. What's happening, hunky chick? Hey, Anna, give me a call here. Um, you got that all confused about the ATM. And um, I went over to Dave's last night. He wouldn't even give me five dollars. Uh, I guess uh, tonight sometime, after midnight, I could, you know, go to the ATM. I should get about 140 out of there because I spent 10 of it at the Tavios and, and um, I don't know, uh, have a nice day. I got it all under control. Have a nice day. I'll see you when you get home or give me a call. Love you, sis. Hmm. <laughs>